leaders in the model city have cut the ribbon or in this case the floss to officially open the doors to a new dental clinic. Kingsport Dental Clinic of the Appalachian Highlands on West Severe Avenue. News Channel 11's Leah Johnson was at that ribbon slash floss cutting and has an inside look at the facility. Hey, Leah. Casey, not only is this new clinic going to be providing dental care to people who cannot afford it, but it will also be providing more jobs and higher educations for students at both East Tennessee State University and the University of Tennessee. Tennessee is ranked somewhere between 46 and 50 on access to care for its citizens, and that's pathetic. I really can't stress that enough. There's so many people in this region who can't afford dental care, travel two, three hours to provide, to find clinics such as what we're looking at here. The new 6,000 square feet clinic will provide free dental care to some patients, but prices are set by a sliding scale based on income. Chris McCart, city manager for the city of Kingsport says, not only will this benefit people in need, but it will also bring more jobs to the region. Our ultimate goal of all this is to train dentists and hygienists and to hopefully deploy them back into the rural areas of East Tennessee. The idea is if we could train folks from the region here, you know, in East Tennessee, most likely they'll stay back and, and increase the, the numbers of dentists in the area. James Reagan, Dean Emeritus for the University of Tennessee Science Center says, the clinic will also be an educational hub for dental students, offering 12 treatment rooms with state-of-the-art equipment. The Tennessee students that train here will be dental students and we're going to begin with students in their fourth year of dental school and then we hope within the next couple of years we'll be able to add a residency. The new clinic will begin operating and accepting applications for new patients by September of this year.